We've done what terms of trade is, tick. We're now going to move on to the factors that change terms of trade, okay? And the easy thing that I'm going to remind you guys is it's only two things. Here we go. So what will improve the terms of trade? It's either going to be um, export prices or import prices. So now for our terms of trade to increase, and I'll put the formula here, I want you guys to pause the video and make a prediction. What has to happen to export prices or import prices, it could be either, for this number to go up? And so it's a bit of basic maths here. Yes, yeah, so just think basic maths. For this terms of trade in the box to go up, what has to happen to the export prices, which is above the line, the, the divided line, or what has to happen to import prices? Pause the video, have a think, take your time. And what has to happen here is either an increase in export prices or a decrease in import prices. So let's have a look how that works. A, um, if export prices are increasing, okay, that could be caused from an increase in the global price of commodities or an increased rate of economic growth of an um, overseas trading partner. Either of these two things are going to cause the price of what we sell to go up. And so that's a cause or a factor, sorry, not a cause, that's a factor that influences the terms of trade to change when export prices change. Your second uh, thing could be import prices can also improve the terms of trade. So here with import prices, they need to fall in order for this terms of trade to go up. So what would cause import prices to fall? Well, we could appreciate the exchange rate, which makes our imports cheaper. Or there could be a fall in the price of an imported intermediary good like oil. So both of those things will cause import prices to fall and therefore terms of trade to rise. This is the key part of the information. Yeah, The thing that will influence the terms of trade is export prices and import prices. And you've got to know which way they've got to go to have a particular effect on the terms of trade. Okay, so when we look into now um, what will worsen the terms of trade, um, we've got to again make a bit of a prediction. So we want this number here to fall, to get lower. Yeah, that's what a worsening of the terms of trade is going to represent. And then, okay, so what's got to happen to export prices for this number to fall? Well, the top number in the equation there has to fall, so we're going to have to see either a decrease in export prices or we're going to see an increase in import prices. And let's have a look and see what that could look like. Okay, so for export prices, they need to fall. Okay, so what might cause a fall in what we sell overseas? Well, it could be a decrease in the global price of commodities. So a lot of the commodities that Australia sells it's a global price, as in it's purely based on the, the factors of supply and demand in the global economy. So the price for coal, for example. Um, and as a result, if there is uh, an oversupply of coal in the global market, for example, that's going to drive the prices down. Here, the price that we get for that coal is then going to fall. Now, whether or not we sell more or less coal is not what we're talking about here. Okay, so you've got to try and take that out of your mind. We don't, when we're talking terms of trade, we don't actually care whether we have sold more or less of the stuff. It's just what has happened to the price. Okay, and if on average the prices of our exports fall, then that is going to make the terms of trade go down. Conversely, if our import prices go up, that's going to make terms of trade go, um, uh, go down as well. Okay, and what could cause that? Well, an appreciation of the uh, uh, da, 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 fall in the price. Yes, appreciation of the exchange rate is going to um, change those particular um, import prices. Okay, import prices to rise. Sorry, so that is going to be depreciation of the exchange rate, um, and that's going to be um, an increase in the price. Sorry, my bad. That's all right. We all make mistakes. Increase in the price 
of imported um, of uh, imported intermediary goods. Okay, so sorry about the confusion there. But our import prices, if they go up, it's going to have a detrimental effect um, on the terms of trade.